hey guys welcome again to my youtube channel in today's video you are going to be learning how to solve command face script execution field with a non-zero ex um, um, exit code okay so this problem is very easy to solve don't get freaked about it okay so what to do to to resolve this issue before we start doing that please and please guys do subscribe to my channel click the subscribe button and the notification bell i solve problems related to flutter kotlin swift you know php and co so without further ado let's get back to the code and let's see how to solve this problem so i'm going to run this again so that you can see how the problem is being made so i'm going to first claim my build okay the build has been claimed then i'm going to um, archive because it is during archive that this problem normally occur if you are um, presenting on simulation is going to work if you are presenting on your real device is going to work so let me archive so um performing the archive on getting to the last stage then the error is going to pop up let's see okay so it's currently archiving Okay, almost done. Now, as you can see, it says was command um, face script execution field with non zero exec, um, exit code. So, to solve this problem, what you need to do is I'm going to follow um, the trees of Android Studio and I'm also going to follow the trees for uh, um, Xcode. So, let's start with the tree of Android Studio to solve this problem. So, first, open your Android Studio projects. Um, let me close the file so that you can see exactly what is really going on so once you open your android studio project here is my port file so it has nothing to do with port file so what you just need to do is navigate to the um to the ios folder for the particular project you are working on the ios folder don't forget ios folder once you get to the ios folder scroll down to port folder now inside the port folder scroll down to target support files now inside the target support files scroll down to port runner inside the port runner then you in, then navigate down to port runner frameworks.sh so as you can see we have port what runners frameworks.sh so if you scroll down inside this um, inside this file you're going to see so many things that has to do with um, um s code and the swift um, cocoa pod things okay so what you just need to do is to scroll down to the shell area where you have um sim linked as you can see we have sim link there so in this current line on line 44 just pass um dash f space that is as you can see this is an iphone iphone f then space um concatenation of the source so you don't need to do much thing just Passing this F alone will solve the problem. So um, click on save. And if I want to use the approach of the X code, it's also very straightforward. Go to your, um, um, what is it called? Your code area. Then you are, you are going to drop down your runner. Once you drop down your runner, scroll down to the pod. Under the pod, you are going to take it down to pods. Under pods, you are going to locate the target support files then under target support files you're going to locate the pods runner the under port runner then you will definitely um see the port runner framework.sh which is what we have here and the f i just added just now is this so as you can see this is the f okay so now what you need to do now is to click on save and after that has been saved this applies for both flutter and i'm very sure the rest of the native development like React and co i believe this will also work for you okay so once you click on uh, once you save that then go to your build let's clear the build folder just to clear what we already have and um click on the products and archive it again so on clicking on the archive then this is going to reprocess and let's see what we are going to get this time around so it's currently processing after saving after hiding the half so let's see what will happen it's currently processing okay that is going let's just put the bit my half is very small as you can see it's actually what um uh, archived the, the the build now the build is ready to be distributed to app store 
So that's cool. So guys, please and please do subscribe to my channel for more more great content like this. See you guys in my next video. Bye.